Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. On today's Two Minutes of Anatomy, I'm going to speak about the extensor hallucis longus muscle. Yes, you heard me, the extensor hallucis longus muscle. The extensor hallucis longus muscle is classified as an extrinsic foot muscle because its origin is outside of the foot, it's on the lower leg, and its insertion is in the foot. It is a thin muscle that is located deep to the tibialis anterior and the extensor digitorum longus muscle. The extensor hallucis longus muscle originates in the anterior surface of the fibula and the inner osseous membrane. Its tendon crosses the anterior section of the ankle joint and it inserts onto the base of the distal phalange of the great toe. The concentric action of the extensor hallucis longus muscle is extension of the great toe. In medical terminologies, the big toe or the great toe is known as the hallux. So the extensor hallucis longus performs extension of the great toe. It also assists in ankle dorsiflexion and ankle inversion and ankle eversion. But its main responsibility, its main concentric action of the extensor hallucis longus is extension of the great toe. The extensor hallucis longus muscle is innervated by the deep fibular nerve, which is also known as the deep perineal nerve, and it is vertebral levels L4, L5, and S1. So remember, the extensor hallucis longus muscle is an extrinsic foot muscle that when contracted concentrically, it extends the great toe.